back to my channel. Today I'm joined with a younger bro. Hello, hello, hello. Jed, tell me, what is the country we've always wanted to go to? Australia. Australia. So a good friend of mine, Georgia Productions, has sent me a box of Australian goodies from Down Under, and I can't do the accent. Are you gonna <laughs> something Australian. Oh God. Um... <laughs> Good day, mate. Good day, mate. Put the shrimp on the barbie. No, I can't do it. See, not happening. We sound like brummies. We don't sound Australian. What? You were from Birmingham. Oh, right. We sound okay. like we come from Birmingham, and that's not even a Birmingham oh, accent because all my accents sound the same. I same, definitely don't worry. need some work. <laughs> Anyways, Georgia and I, we have decided to swap boxes, as she's always wanted to visit the UK, and I've always wanted to visit Australia. So inside here is a box of traditional Aussie goodies, basically. And I have sent her a UK box of things that I think are just traditionally British. So if you want to go check out her video, then definitely do so. I will link it down in the description box. Please go and subscribe to Georgia. She is absolutely amazing and absolutely hilarious. But without further ado, are you ready to see what's inside? I'm just hoping this chocolate. <laughs> I'm sure there will be. <laughs> Right, Jed, here we go. Oh, this is cute. Look. Oh, she's, she's actually so more creative than you. She really is. Okay, so George has actually written down all the things that are inside the box and what they are, basically, which is actually really thoughtful and really cute. So we have that. And then it's this nice is what vegetables. the box looks like. So this right here, I can tell it's George's merch, and not gonna lie, goes with the jumper that I'm wearing right now. What do you think? Uh, I don't really have words. <laughs> My yellows are clashing, so Jed, this is gonna look better on you. It's so, so saffron, you oh. just made it so much tighter on your <laughs> no, head. No, it didn't. I have a really small head. Jed, you look like a little surfer dude. I thought it looked like Pikachu. We also have an Australian inflatable hand. Who knows what the traditional sport is in Australia, because I have no oh, idea rugby, where you maybe. this hand. Rugby? Rugby, they're insane at rugby. Golf? Cricket? No, it's rugby. <laughs> I don't think it is. It's rugby, they're so good at rugby. So if we went to a rugby game, we'd have this hand. Yeah. These look incredible. I have oh. recently started loving Snickers. These are the weirdest <clears throat> things. I mean, they look Snickers. unbelievable. I don't like Snickers, but they look unbelievable. They look bizarre though. Like, we have Snickers in the UK, but we don't have these weird pod things, so let's give it a go. Oh, they smell so good. They smell like Snickers. Yeah. Oh my goodness, they're so weird. No, that's two together. What? Sam. That's two together. Is it? Yeah. I was gonna say, does oh, it they all are? Oh no, they're not. They're not. That is two together. Anyway. Cheers. Oh my goodness. These are incredible. I hate Snickers and they're alright to be fair. Mm. So what else is in the box, Jed? Go for it. What are you going for? Oh, they're cute. You a can't run a uh, kangaroo. <laughs> that is everything that I know about Australia. So they you. have. <laughs> Kangaroos and koala bears. And if I go, I want to see them both. Yeah, it's a little token from Australia there. Oh my goodness, look, it's one of those little clip on ones. Yeah, more clip on Look! <laughs> this is absolutely bizarre. And it actually makes me feel a little bit sick just looking at it. It's Nutri Grain oh, to that go. Looks amazing. Banana and honey smash, thick and creamy protein squeezer. How can that make you feel sick? Oh. I'll have that first. We go to the gym a lot, so we do try and have a lot of protein. So I don't know if this is like another thing for protein shake or what is it like? Because <laughs> his face doesn't. It's nice, that's too sickly though. Oh, I'll probably love it I could it not have a drink. I, I could love not it just then. drink that casually. Because I love anything sickly. <clears throat> wow. It's good, very good. It tastes like your honey and banana. I don't know how I feel about that. I love anything sickly. Yeah, I don't know. Do you have this on its own? Anything sickly. I couldn't I couldn't have this on its own, yeah. I'm with Jed on that one. Next up we have Tim Tams. They spoke about this. So Lily and Georgia oh. spoke about these all the time and they could not believe that I'd never tried them. So it's a biscuit. To me it kind of looks like a bourbon. Yeah, I was about to say it literally looks identical to a bourbon and I love bourbon. Georgia's basically just said that these are a classic Australian biscuit and actually no they amazing. look like they look like penguins yeah, don't they, they? Do. that's what they look like not bourbons literally looks like a club penguin a cheers club penguin yeah mm. oh they taste a little bit like club penguin but milkier chocolate it's like creamy i like this but really good now i know why they raved about these because they're great yeah, I love another one Alright, Jen. <laughs> you know, we've got a lot to go through because there's a lot in this box. Veggie mites. 
Okay, I've always wanted to try this. It's basically the Australian version of Marmite. So oh, you can smell vegetarian. the Marmite, right? <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> it is a Marmite. It's Vegemite. And I've always wondered if it tastes like... I can smell it Yes, now. thank you. Always wondered if it tastes like actually Marmite. Because why is it called something different? Why is, is it just a different brand? Why is it a like, yeah, it's weird, isn't it? Because our mom might in like a little tub, so it's weird. And apparently, they have absolutely oh, so everything better. Vegemite. There are Aussie shapes Vegemite flavour crackers in the shape of Australia. They have other shapes and flavours like barbecue and pizza, but this is special edition. So they also have these here, which are the Vegemite and cheese shapes. Look at these. Why am I so obsessed with Marmite? Yeah, weird, isn't it? In the UK, you either love it or hate it, but I feel like more people actually dislike it. Right, we're gonna get some bread so we can actually put the Vegemite on it. Here goes. Ooh. Ooh. So it's definitely darker than Marmite. Smell. Don't you think? It does smell strong. Yeah. Hmm. It's like not as strong though. Yeah, it's not as strong. Marmite's That's still it. stronger than this. But it literally tastes That's like Marmite. That's really good. Mm. It's cool. Right, what did you think of that? I mean, I think it was better than Marmite, to be fair. It was like more, it was like basically a less strong version of Marmite. Exactly, that's, in the what, UK. that's what we needed, really. Yeah, we'll probably actually love it. But now, let's try the Vegemite and cheese crackers. These are limited editions, feel lucky. I can't believe they're in the shape of Australia. That is brilliant. Not anymore. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Not anymore. Oh my goodness, these are... Mm. Insane. It tastes like those things in America. What things in America? Those those things that we love. Those round cheesy things. Or they just taste like mini cheddars with Yeah, they just taste like really good mini cheddars. Mm. I'm gonna lie. They're great. I could... Oh. Wow. They're like a banging 10 out of 10. Right, okay. These are called Arnott's. These are apparently an Australian biscuit brand. Come on. I hate coconut. Mm. Mm. Incredible. Absolutely incredible. Mm, it's disgusting. <laughs> it doesn't agree. I think these are insane. Coconut is the worst thing in the whole this world. This is like the <clears throat> best biscuit I've ever had. Mo wow. Oh, oh they have got dairy milk. Oh my god. No, no, no. Oh Actually, god. Jane. 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 I've just got so excited. You actually won't believe what they've got. I just Close saw your it. eyes. Close your eyes. <laughs> right. We have these things in the UK called Freddos. They don't have Freddos. They have Caramella Koala. It's the same thing Why as a Freddo. Why did you get that excited? But a Koala Bear. Because like Freddos are our like most popular bar and it's literally the same, but a Koala Bear. That is so cute. <laughs> Do you think that's the coolest thing? I think it's all right. It's really excited me. It literally looks like a Freddo, but a Koala Bear. Yeah, they look like a Spencer version of Freddo. Yeah. So it's dairy milk as well, so it literally is the exact same thing, but a Koala Bear. I'm just hoping that the dairy milk is the same as ours. Oh, it's got oh. caramel in it. Well, it is called Caramella oh Koala. My goodness, and that's what Freddo's amazing. like anyway, they have caramel in. No, they don't. Yeah, they do. No. I haven't bought since I got up from 20p anyway. More. Oh my God. More. So good. Mm. It tastes like American chocolate. It doesn't taste like our dairy milk. Yeah, definitely not. But that's it's better. great. It's right. yeah. Why not? It basically tastes like an expensive Freddo, which I'm sure it is because our Freddos are like twenty p. Veg. Oh, why? Oh. Everything, Marmite. <laughs> Everything is veggie chips. Look at that. I feel like these are gonna be great. Oh, they're not veggie. They're not veggie, Mike. I don't think. Oh, they're just I think veggie. Because they're veggie chips. They're supposed to be a healthy alternative to chips, but they taste so yummy, I don't think they are very healthy. That is what Georgia says. Oh, they smell, they smell like prawn crackers. Really, no, they're really soury. Sour and cream. Sour? Sour and cream all over. It's a prawn oh cracker. No, things you get from Chinese shops. <laughs> a prawn cracker. <laughs> oh yeah, it's a prawn cracker. <laughs> prawn crackers in the UK are so unhealthy. So if these are healthy, I want to eat these every day. I was not expecting that. Jim? Less than 100 calories. Not in the whole bag. No way. Oh, but it per 20 grams. Good day. Uh, I can't do it with my throat. <laughs> 10 different pre recorded Auss Aussie sayings. Oh, that's actually really helpful. We needed this earlier. We did. Mate. Mate. He'll be right. Good. <laughs> what does he say? Good day, mate. Good day, mate. Good day, mate. I'm pretty sure I'm better at that. Let us know who does it better. 
<laughs> Go. You are beauty. Is that what you said? Beauty. I have no clue what you said. You a beauty. Alright, that's me without a doubt. Crikey. 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 No worries. No worry. Oh no, he just got to stop me. <laughs> Do I look crumble? I haven't seen a bar in the UK that looks like this. Oh, actually, is it yeah, a little bit like a crunchy? That, yeah, crunchy all over. That's weird. Yeah, it's honeycomb. It's literally a crunchy. Oh yeah, you smell exactly like crunchy. Ready? Oh, it's gonna cheese you. Mm. Oh. Softer version. The honeycomb isn't as strong. No. I think our crunch is nicer because the chocolate tastes a bit weird. Mm, yeah. I don't like that chocolate. It tastes a bit coffee. Mm, yeah, I don't like that chocolate. Oh my god, it gets worse and worse. Right, this is what they're called Anzac. Anzac. Anzac stands for Australian New Zealand oh, these Army are Corps. Amazing. These biscuits were first developed for World War One as they kept a long time and would be sent to troops overseas. They were pretty hard by the time they received them. Oh, that's yes. a nice little background story. So even if we eat them in a year's time, we still can. Oh, right, I get it. They smell like a ginger biscuit. Mum is going to love these. They smell insane. Ready? Can you cheers me now? Okay, cheers. Cheers. Oh. They definitely are hard. <laughs> I think they were 100 years old. If they were harder than this by the time they got them, I just hope they had a dentist there. They taste all right. Nah. No. No. They taste kind of coconutty. Yeah, exactly. These. I'm excited more than most because they look right up my street. Oh my god. Yeah, goodness. they look insane. I wonder if Arnott's is like their version of our McFitties. Like that's our biscuit brand that we have all the time everywhere. Oh my or is god. it insane? Oh, it smells like a um the after eight. Thing. Yeah, after eight. Oh my god. Oh, mm. oh my goodness, it's the best. Back around eating all day. I mean he hasn't actually eaten anything else but anything in this video, but <laughs> yeah. That's what I mean. Mm. This is the best thing we've tried. This is a thick version of an after eight and you get so many you get so many it's oh it's creamy it's it's great oh. this is this is worth every calorie in this biscuit i'm desperate to try this bar because i have absolutely no idea what it is and it's called chocito it's chewy caramel fudge country balls and loads of chocolate which is right up my street Taste is gone. I'm lost for words. That is just beautiful. Don't even know what these little things are, so Jed and I are just gonna have to try them at one go. Ready? Here you go. Oh, you love oh they're chocolate. So, yeah, I did not expect them to be chocolate. I did not expect them to be chocolate. I thought it was gonna be veggie mite. Really chewy. Like, the chewiest thing I've ever actually eaten. My teeth are just stuck to it. Mm. Oh, I'm gonna get it out of my teeth. You are very chewy. It's the chewiest thing I've ever eaten. Next up, summer roll. This is coconut. So oh, right up Jed Street. <laughs> can we some coconut, please? So I think they love coconut, and I think they just love veggie mite. Can't be these as well. Yeah, which we, we have. have those. So um. Don't even need to try that. Don't even need to try these. Yeah, I can't try that. I'm sorry. I can't. That's full of coconut. Oh my middle. goodness! Wow. That's just coconut. I know it is. I can't try it. It's like peanut I'm butter. Smell it. Oh, that's even worse. It's like nuts and coconut. Actually, it's quite sickly. It was nicer when I first tried it. Like. Oh, no, that's the cutest. <laughs> Dairy milk, furry friends. Oh, these look good. They I look love good. the fact that they're aus like Australian typical animals. Like, it's just so cute. Is that platypus? I don't know how platypus is. Is that platypus? Yeah, it is. Oh, I only know them for Phineas and Ferb. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Kangaroo. I'm eating Perry. What's a kiwi? I've uh -huh. never even seen a kiwi before. <laughs> no, you didn't. Well, I didn't see a picture, did I? So it's not really my fault. But I know it's an animal. I've just never seen it before. <laughs> That's just a letdown. It doesn't even have the animal on it. I can't bring your bike because I can't mention mine. <laughs> you can guess you love chocolate. Yeah, I don't like that. It's dairy milk. That's not dairy milk at all. Actually, it does taste different. Our dairy milk is nicer. Milk chocolate macadamias toffee. Just saying, this is awful packaging, like. Oh, that's bad, yeah. That is awful. I hate things like, oh yeah, look, show the camera. <laughs> Go on, beauty girl. I made it off yours from like two years ago. 
You know, I love chocolate raisins. These are as good as chocolate raisins. That was amazing, These by the way. Like Fizzle, I recommend Fizzers. This is the best thing. I keep saying this, but this is actually the best thing I've eaten in the entire video. Georgia has written that she's included her t-shirt. I'd rather have two chins and two faces because she's always showing her double... What This is what she said. Her double and triple chins on Instagram. Which, to be fair, she's actually hilarious and she does do that. Like, she is just amazing. You have to go and check out her Instagram as well. But this is, like, the best merch shop I've seen. Love it. Very last thing in the bottom of the box, we have these really cute little Aussie stencils. So Jed and I are gonna go off, do some, do some Aussie artwork, aren't we? I will win. Just <laughs> saying, it's competition. Anyways, we're gonna end this video here. The box is now empty. Thank you so much, Georgia, for actually collaborating with me on this video. I have just thoroughly enjoyed it, and I've, I've got some well, new favourite snacks. Ooh. Wow! And I just got hit in the face. Jed app is absolutely I actually look loving a life. Boy. <laughs> you just need to put on Georgia's mask. Australia. Anyways, thank you so much guys for watching and let me know down in the comments below if you've tried any of these Australian snacks and your favourite that you've tried and your least favourite. Thank you so much and I hope to see you soon. Mwah. Bye! Bye.